Hi guys and welcome. So today I am going to share with you what I have completed on the Disney Traveler's Journal or Traveler's Notebook or Junk Journal, um, whatever you want to call it. It is so cute and because there's so few pages on it, it was really easy to put together. I did struggle with the cover because I wanted it to be flat and I don't really like how flat everything came out. Um, I think it would have been cuter if there was a little more dimension to it, but I think it'll work for what we are going to use it for. This is the back. I stuck with the same closure that I used on my October daily and on the junk journal that I sent um, Samantha. And so it has this little charm right here. It has this these little Mickey ears right here. I still have glue on my fingers from um, putting this together. So here are some pockets. These are the same deep pockets um, that I used in the previous notebook. This is just a cut apart. And I added some sequin here and then back here I just covered up the thread with the um, with a stick with a die cut and some ephemera pieces I added a few sequin on these fireworks just so it could have a little sparkle when you flip the page um, but I didn't want to add too many because I'm not sure what I'm going to be adding to that page I really like this page right here. I think it's super cute. Um, I got this idea from Shara. She had made a Christmas notebook and she had some little tags where she, um, you could pull it out. I think it was a soldier or like the Nutcracker. Um, and so anyway, I just thought that was so cute. So I tried to do the same thing on here. These are a Mickey and Minnie head. Super cute. I created these on my silhouette. This opens up just like so. This is a pocket so I plan to put in some um, just some paper for journaling and maybe some cut aparts. I have some ephemera pieces here. I think this is so cute. It's a boarding pass. This is just a cut apart from the collection. I used some of those branding strips to make this little banner here. And then um, all of this trim is from the giveaway that I hosted this summer. Um, and it is just so cute. It was perfect for this project. I love this apple right here, this poison apple. I made this using some um, specialty paper from the 12 by 12 cardstock shop. Um, I really, really, as a matter of fact, it's this paper right here and the paper is what inspired me to make one of these. I thought this would be a cute page to add our favorite snacks um, on and so it's just really cute and there's a lot of snacks on this paper right here so I thought that would be perfect these are some little Mickey hands and they move and then you can just tuck some pictures back there or a park map this is also some specialty paper from the 12 by 12 cardstock shop I absolutely love this acetate I, it was perfect for making this little um, zipper pouch right here I added this little castle charm to it I don't think you can see that super cute and then this is the final page and that is it you guys I think it came out super cute um, it was so fun to make this these are some little charms that we had um, from our last visit um, and it's like a little bracelet and so I just took apart it kind of tarnished so I just took it apart and added these little charms to um, the traveler's notebook so let me know if you have any questions um, on how I did any of this let me know um, if you've been to the park recently I know that there's been a lot a lot of changes um, so 
yeah, give me all of your tips and tricks. And thank you so much for stopping by and I will talk to you soon. Bye for now.